Hello and welcome to this Power BI video. We are continuing our tutorial series and in today's tutorial we are going to discuss Power Query functions which are related to text which are start, middle and end. So let's start. We have this date table. So let's look at what data it has. So this table actually has data which is basically UK date and it is not detected as a date. If I click on this column you can see this is text data type and I have a UK format dates where I have actually imported it as uh, the text and I would like to split it into the uh, year part and the month part and the date part and reconstruct uh, it as a date. So I'm going to do that in Power Query now. So I'm going to go to Power Query. So in the home tab under transform data, we have transform data. That's where we are going to go. And then we are going to go to this table. Now in this table, what I'm going to do is I'm going to introduce a new column. So I'm going to say add column and under the add column, I have this custom column. So in the custom column, let me call first of all I, i'll we'll do it step by step let's separate out here first of all so you, what function we are going to use is text dot end so we have this function text dot end and once you cl click on this you need to be a bit more careful because uh, power query sometime will not replace the existing one it may actually um, give the new one completely so you need to be a bit more careful about that so you can actually uh, use the date column out here so the first argument and the second argument would be the number so i have four numbers which i need so this is my uh, text dot and and there is no syntax error it is showing to me so what i can do is now i can actually say okay so i got the year what i'm going to do is i'm going to um, uh, change this one only i'm not going to create another one i'm going to call it year month and now i'm going to do is I can actually give some space in between and let me try text dot middle okay again text dot middle I'm going to try out in the text dot middle what I'm going to do is I'm going to again write down date column and you can see the third uh, character is from where it is starting the first second and third uh, third is character is one where so i will start four comma two let me say so so and let me end it so no so third character is the one where we have to start because this is power query starting with zero so zero one two three so zero one two three comma two okay and then let me again modify this column then I'm going to is going to get text dot start text dot start and then in the text dot start again I'm going to take date comma first two characters only okay and we have not given a space let's give a space out here No syntax error we can do so we have got this now this is basically treating it as one two three so i can actually go here and instead of type any i can make it as a type date okay but what i'm going to do is i'm going to revert this step i go here and let me do one more thing uh, let me so th that is going to do correctly and one more step we can do but it might not change the data type we have date so let makes it text dot from text and then we do all these changes and then we say okay and then we can check okay fine the value seems fine we can change the data type to date okay so and then uh, we can uh, use this so we can say close and apply and then we can check it out here it is again the date column which is showing so try this thing out uh, do let us know what else you want us to cover in this particular series Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Press the bell icon so that you can get notification for the new video. Thank you.